always taking action for you. First, we begin with breaking news. Four people shot inside a tax preparation office on Detroit's east side. Chopper 7 over that scene at the strip mall on Gratiot near East Grand Boulevard. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig is on the scene right now with the very latest. Kim? Yes, Jeff, the 19 year old suspected shooter is in custody. And in just a moment, you'll see exclusive video of him and the gun. Now, down the street here, down Gratiot, is where Detroit police snatched him up as he tried to run away. Now, if we swing over to the right here, you'll see the tax company is on the corner here. We're told the shooter and two women he was with argued with tax workers about a refund check. Then witnesses say all hell broke loose. What we know is the suspect. And two other individuals came to the, uh, the tax location, uh, and one person was requesting her payment. Payment wasn't ready. Uh, there was a physical altercation involving one of the suspects. Uh, the third, the person with the weapon, uh, part of this dispute began to fire the weapon. It, it sounds like right now he fired the weapon four times. Uh, and then one additional shot was fired as he was leaving the location. All of us just ducked because we heard like about eight gunshots. And then when, while I'm going to open the door to see what happened, I see a, a black male run this way. And Do you have a gun? Yeah, he had a gun in his hand, and I seen a couple of girls running with him too. There is an out, two outstanding suspects. The one suspect that we are looking for that started the dispute and who is now wanted for felonious assault. Her name is Angel Moore, Angel Chantel Moore. She's a, described as a female black, uh, five foot five, and, and no other information at this point. Detroit, Detroit police right inside the tax service company still investigating, talking to witnesses, witnesses who are not shot and are able to help them try and piece all of this together. We should tell you that of the four people shot, I'm told that three are in serious condition, one is in critical condition. But as you just heard the chief say, they're still looking for those two women, one in particular because they believe she's one of the ones who physically assaulted one of the workers inside when all of this jumped off. And her name is, again, Angela Chantel Moore. We're hoping that uh, police will be able to give us a picture of her. But again, if you know this woman, you know anything about this case, please call Detroit police right away. Reporting live on Detroit's east side, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Back to you. Okay.